Hello, my name is Noelia Romero. I'm with McGee and Realty Group and I'm here with Danielle, a great friend of mine, who's going to educate me and us about um, school in Tom's River. So tell me about your son, his age, where does he go? So my son is Zach, he is 15 years old. He currently goes to Central Regional High School. Okay. Uh, we've uh, done a little bit in Tom's River and a little bit in Basil. now. We did Washington Street, actually we did Beachwood, and then Washington Street in um, for elementary school in the Tom's River School District, Beachwood Elementary and Washington Street School Elementary. Loved both of them. They were very great. Um, and then around the time um, that COVID hit, uh, we actually ended up transferring to Central Regional Middle School. Uh, and now we continued on and now we are in Central Regional High School. So I'm confused, just like I'm sure many other people are. It sounds like that's a lot of schools. It's a lot of schools. And different <laughs> towns, yes. but all still kind of like under the Tom's River Regional umbrella, like or affiliate. Like explain to me how, why he's in Central, because you live in Tom's River. Right. So I live in Tom's River. Um, when well, before he first started elementary school, I actually lived in Beachwood, which is why he went to oh, Beachwood Elementary okay. School. But Beachwood, South Tom's River, Pine Beach, Silverton, they're yeah. all within the Tom's River umbrella. Like those are all Tom's River school systems. Actually, thirteen elementary schools in Tom's River, mm, <laughs> and they are all over. There's a lot. Um, so then, when I moved to Tom's River, he uh, switched to Washington Street Elementary School, which has been great. He was there for probably about four or five years to finish up his elementary school, and then COVID happened, and everything was now remote. And for <laughs> my son, it was like awful <laughs> like, right. just trying to get him to sit down and focus on all these classes every day it was just terrible so i found out that um bayville elementary school central regional middle school at the time had uh has a choice program it's called and what you can do is you fill out an application submit it to the school and you can basically go to the school district without actually having to live in the school district that's wild to me. Yeah, so we submitted our application and then for seventh grade, which is actually Tom's River Schools, middle schools is uh, sixth, seventh, and eighth, okay. but Central Regional is only seventh and eighth. Okay. So it was perfect timing. He started in seventh grade with all these other kids that were just starting middle school too. So it was kind of like, all right, everybody's still new, so it doesn't matter that you're the new kid. Right. And um, he's been there ever since, you know. It, it, what's kind of cool about the choice thing, too, I just want to say is once you fill out and submit the choice application to the school, you're in for life. Like, unless you decide mm -hmm. to make a change, you don't have to resubmit it every year. It's like once they say, okay, you're good to go to our school, you're in. 